Hello guys, we'll continue our previous lesson, lesson 11, about measurements of DC voltage using an oscilloscope. First, let's define the oscilloscope. What is an oscilloscope? Oscilloscope is an instrument that measures and visualizes the electric voltage between two points of an electric circuit. Let's take a look at this picture. We can see that oscilloscope has a screen and scale keys that represents a vertical sensitivity and another one for horizontal sensitivity. In this lesson, we'll explain what's vertical sensitivity. Vertical sensitivity is a vertical scale of volt of unit volt per division. The oscilloscope has two terminals, ground or mass and face or ground and this symbol for each one. Let's focus now on the connection of oscilloscope. The phase terminal or channel must be connected toward positive terminal, while ground or mass toward negative terminal. How do we measure the voltage using an oscilloscope? Oscilloscope measures the voltage by using this formula U equal as V times Y where U is a voltage of unit SI unit volt as V is a vertical sensitivity of SI unit volt per division Y is the number of division okay all unit is division for example from this screen okay Y a number of vertical sensitivity of vertical division is a 3.4 division and the vertical sensitivity the scale equal 5 volt per division by using this formula u equal as v times y as v 5 volt per division times 3.4 division equal 17 volt what's the meaning of as v equal 5 volt per division it means each one division represent 5 volt another example as v equal 10 volt per division then each one division represent 10 volt. No. You will oscilloscope read U face ground. And yani from face to ground. For connection, a dry cell has two terminals, positive and negative. Face terminal of an oscilloscope must be connected toward positive one. And the ground must be connected toward negative. Then the oscilloscope shows the luminous line displaced upward and the oscilloscope measures U, P, N. Since the oscilloscope reads U face ground from face to ground and the face terminal and the face connected toward positive one terminal. And moreover, in this case, Y greater than zero above X axis, luminous line displaced upward, then U, P, N greater than zero. Another case, if we reverse the connection of an oscilloscope, the phase terminal of an oscilloscope connected toward negative and the, the ground connected toward positive, then the oscilloscope shows the luminous line displaced downward below x-axis and the oscilloscope measures U and P. Since the phase terminal of an oscilloscope connected toward N, negative and in this case, y is greater less than zero than u l n p less than zero. First, take as v equal six volt per division. For example, the oscilloscope in first case measures u p n. Y u p n equal y times as v. Y one two three four four division above horizontal axis times the scale six volt per division. Then the answer equal twenty four volt. While if we connect, if we reverse the connection of oscilloscope, then the oscilloscope measures U and P in the second case. U and P equal Y times as V. Y from the figure 1, 2, 3, 4, minus 4 division, since the luminous line displaced downward below horizontal axis, minus 4 times 6 equal minus 24 volt. Then U, P, N equal minus U and P. In case of a sweeping is on, the oscilloscope shows the a luminous horizontal straight line above the horizontal axis or a luminous straight line below the horizontal axis. 
it depends on the conduction of oscilloscope. While in case of a sweeping is off, the oscilloscope shows a luminous spot above the center of the screen on the vertical axis or a luminous spot below the center of the screen on the vertical axis. An application about DC voltage. Now, the oscilloscope as it's connected, does it measure UMP or PN? In this case, UPN, since the oscilloscope measure you face ground and the face, the white channel, is connected to P. The comb terminal of the voltmeter is it connected to point B or C. Explain. Since from the given, the voltmeter indicates 4 volt positive reading. Positive reading, then the comb terminal connected toward negative. Then, comb terminal of the voltmeter is connected to point C since it indicates positive reading. Determine the voltage U, P, A, U, C, and U, A, P. P, A across closed switch. U, P, A equals zero. Closed switch act as a connecting wire. U, C, and its connecting wire, then its voltage is zero volt. Why? Voltage across U, A, B, across lamp L1, by using the law of addition of voltage in series connection, U UPN equal UPA plus UAB plus UBC plus UCN, then U AP equal 5 volt. The division of the luminous line held up or down. Explain. Since the phase terminal connected to a toward positive pole, then the luminous line displaced upward. Now, copy the circuit and add an ammeter A1 across lamp 1 and indicate a positive value and ammeter 2 okay, across lamp 2 and displaced negative value. As showing in this circuit, ammeter A1 connected beside L1 and its comb terminal okay, toward N, toward negative. And moreover, ammeter connected in series with L1. While a meter A2 also connected in series with L2, while the comb terminal is toward P, positive pole, since it indicates negative value. Now, the meter A1 reads 0.7 ampere, specifies the current across lamp 2 and I. Now, by using the law of uniqueness of current in series connection, I equal I1 equal I2 equal 0.7 ampere. Ampere.